As the population continues growing all across the triangle, our area is getting more and more diverse. Michael Perchek is joining us live now in Raleigh for the latest part of our Boomtown series. And Michael, we are seeing different types of restaurants and a lot of shops opening up. Steve, Diane, that's what's happening here. K-Town Market has existed as a cafe and grocery store for several years. Now they are using their upstairs portion, transforming it into Opon, a K-pop store, hoping to capitalize off the increasingly popular music and growing population. For Madura Banda, the annual Diwali Festival provides a cultural comfort and an opportunity to highlight her art. That is a tradition, tradition from thousands of years back. Banda started henna by Madura with her husband last year in Mooresville, a town in which Indian Americans are the largest ethnic group. While having built an interest is important, it's only part of their sales. Uh, what we have seen from our business, it's not just restricted to Indian population or the it's more diverse and it, it was actually we caught by surprise as to how uh, the response. My kid who is a second generation, he finds no difference, you know, like and he has been exposed to all kinds of uh, diversity and culture and thanks to the school system. The town that, council member Satish Garamela says that's been reflected in the types of businesses and activities prevalent in Morrisville. He believes the town's proximity to local colleges and universities, plus the region's booming tech and life sciences fields, has made it attractive for foreign-born populations and a natural fit for cricket. I jokingly say, like to many of uh, the spouses, that uh, your husbands will not found anywhere will be found in the cricket ground. In 2021, India had the third most number of people moved to the state of any country. Just behind it on the list was South Korea. In total, Wake County's AAPI population doubled from 2010 to 2020. And it changes your perspective on a lot of things. I think it opens everyone's mind to a lot of things, which I think is always a positive experience, especially here in America.